This is the fifth ministerial meeting where we are discussing different items in order to, well, update the WTO rulebook. We are discussing industrial subsidies, uh, forced technology transferred. We had a very successful uh, outcome where we discussed the increased transparency in the WTO issue where some, uh, many other countries have sponsored that, so that is not discussed in, in Geneva. And I'm uh, looking forward to take stock and to move forward today. Well, we are from the European Union side in the final preparations to uh, uh, finalize our mandates on um, an industrial goods trade agreement and uh, conformity assessment, which would facilitate trade between us. And th that preparation is ongoing. Well. We're not forming a coalition against China. We are worried about many of the Chinese practices uh, because there are no real rules for that in the WHO, and that's what we're trying to, to, to remedy. So we are trying to see if we can update the WTO rulebook within the multilateral system and see if we can uh, find ways to draft uh, new rules here and then eventually, of course, engage with, with other members. Well, we have said that we are willing to include uh, tariffs on all industrial goods, autos included, if the Americans should, should wish so. But we have been very clear that from the EU side we are not going to discuss agriculture, as from the US side they will not discuss uh, the Jones Act uh, by America, public procurement, geographical indications, things that are usually there. So what we have said, and that goes back to the uh, statement by the two presidents, the 26th, 27th of uh, July this year, last year actually, uh, that they would not be agricultural. But we are doing the preparations from our side to have a mandate ready from, uh, first the Commission would propose to member states, but of course we are discussing it all, all the time, so that is what we need first, and the process in the Congress is not ready. Commissioner, have you received any um, assurance that the 232 report might be put on hold? No, we haven't. Uh, but as I said, we we are under the assumption that whatever is in that report, or on cars, I suppose you, you, you refer to, uh, we will not be affected because um, you know, the, the, the agreement by the presidents was that as long as we are talking and trying to find common positive ground, uh, there will be no new tariffs. We have uh, made that very clear that from our side we are not going to include agriculture. Um, that has been, been stated very clearly from, from the beginning. So in the mandate that we are preparing, we are uh, focusing on industrial goods, which in itself would be very good for both sides if we could get rid of, of uh, tariffs on, on all industrial goods. It would uh, facilitate and make trade cheaper from both the US and, and the European side. So that would be a good, uh, you know, a good positive outcome of, of our trade relations.